version because I'm waiting for people to actually come in. But welcome to the stream. And also, if you're watching the YouTube version, I promise that I'm working on fixing the ad thing. I don't know what happened with the ad stuff. When I looked into the ad stuff, I was like, hopefully they're putting ads like one or two of them. Hello, Soup. Nab's here. I don't know if you've experienced this in the archive version of these streams, um, but there's like uh, 27 ads in the first 10 minutes <laughs> and not in any other versions of it. So that's not good. I fixed it. Right now what I'm doing as I wait for other people to come in, I'm gonna go get the the better version of the sword. So we're gonna get a good sword for the last two dungeons in the in the game here. We are pretty much almost done with the trade mini game. There's not much more we have to do. We select, there we go. So we just need to run into um the witchy lady. So we just need to walk around until she shows up and hits us and then we give her a sad book, and then we're all good. Everyone happy. And then we have to give the sad book to, I think, the guy in the past. I think she should show up right here. No, not right here. Or right here. Nope. How about here? Nope. Here. No. Here. Maybe I'm thinking of the past. Let me quickly... Witch drive fights only happen in rough neighborhoods. It's true. People don't like to admit it, but it's 100% true. It's a little... <laughs> she specifically only goes to very specific parts of the town. So... I can't remember if she's only in the past or if she's in the future. No, she's in both timelines. I'm actually, how is she able to go from two timelines? Because here she is. Alright. Come here, witch lady. Yeah! And here she is with the big suck. Hey, that book. That's the touching book I need to take to syrup. Why do you have it? Let me read it. What? Oh my. Ooh. Wah. How touching. You got a magic ore. It cuts a mean wake. Thanks, it was good. Take this, it's the first one I made. Syrup never gave me any compliments on it. I'll keep this book. Oh, No touching. <laughs> no touching the, the witch, please. I don't know, I like Maple. There's nothing wrong with Maple. If Link ever stopped screwing around with these princesses, he could just get with a perfectly fine witch woman. That's my feeling on it. Alright, let's go talk to this man right here. Because he needs a magic ore for his stuff. For his, I think, wrath contest. Yeah, there's always money in the maple st in the maple stand. Give him the magic ore. Hello. Welcome to the welcome to the stream. We're currently going for the best sword. That's what we're doing now before I continue on with my adventure. We're right at the end of the trading mini game, so I'm just going to do it. All right. Next go here. We also, do I sound alright? Do you hear the Obviously, you probably hear some of the stuff in the background, but not everything. Rolling Ridge. Is it Rolling Ridge? I cannot remember the name of the Goron Town. There is absolutely nothing mini. It might be down below. I think it is. Audio's fine, perfect. Alright, let's go back to the future. Play a little tune. And everything should be fine. What do we gamba today? I don't know. You'll figure it out. No! Stuck in tree! Pain. Unbearable pain. I don't know what happens to Link when he gets stuck, but I assume it's pain if he's coming back. Alright, there we go. Now we gotta talk to the old man by the sea, or maybe he is in the past. Maybe I'm dumb. Let me go back. Let me go back to the past now. I can't remember where he is, if he's in the past or in the future. We talked to him for sure, though. He's probably... 
Let me see. <laughs> Leave me be. He's somewhere here, though. Yeah, he's probably down here. There he is. Hello, old man. How I miss the smell of the sea. Give him the sea ukulele? Yes. Thank you. The hero sword. Here we go. The greatest sword in the history of mankind. It is broken. It's broken? What a great sound. Fucking cheapskate. So now we have to go to the guy who fixes the swords. The guy who tried to murder us last time we tried to fix a sword. He's in Symmetry Village. No, that's not it. Uh, I forget. It's symmetry it is. It totally is in the... Alright. Play a little tune. Don't worry, soon you'll have plenty of stuff for me to gamble on. There's only two dungeons left now. Monkeys! Goodbye, monkey. There we go. Symmetry Village. Shit, did I just go... I can't remember if he's in the right place. I need to switch back to my regular sword. <laughs> this is what happens. What? There we go. Perfect. We will ignore any potential chance of it hurting me. Now the question is, was this guy in the past or was he in the future? I cannot remember. You should watch last season of Samurai Jack again. It's really good. Mm. If only I could remember where the fuck this man lives. He lives in like an annoying place. That's what I remember. Doesn't live in any of there. That's where all the women live. This is where the guy with the funny mustache lives. Alright, we're leaving. Hopefully we don't go back. Okay, we don't. He has to be over here, then. Let's go find him! Mm -hmm. He has to be somewhere here. In the future, in the present, somewhere. I think I have to go here? Is that right? I think. I remember him- all I remember about him is that he wants to murder me. I don't actually remember where he is. I just remember it's somewhere here. I don't know why he would want to kill a paying customer. Nope, that's the guy who sings. I don't know why he lives over here. The house is whack. Let's go back. Have to deal with the repercussions of the damn mermaid suit. I really hope mermaid suit is not in the next game, by the way. I really don't like it. <laughs> it's super annoying. Even though I found a trick to it. Okay, he has to be in the in the future. Here we go here. Play a little song. Go back here. Oh no, if there was a Rayman- if there was a mermaid suit in Rayman 2, it would make the game worse than it already is. And it's already kind of bad. Oh, are you kidding me? I have the no choice. <laughs> Shouldn't have put it right at the entrance. That was my bad on that one. Maybe if I go here and then... Yeah, I think that was the trick here. Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Did I make it the right place? Nope. It is someone's favorite game ever. Let me tell you, there's some people who will tell you to your face that Rayman 2 is one of the greatest 3D platformers out there. Those people are lying to you. They're lying directly at your face. I'm going to find this man's house wherever it may be. 
Let me go up. Maybe the answer was actually go up. As a kid, I played it a whole bunch, though. No, not enough to get past anything. Hello there, ball in 1022. How's it going? Welcome to the chat where I'm currently looking for some dude's house. That I swear to God I will find someday. I may as well just look up where the hell this man lives. I have no idea. Oops, I'm actually streaming what I'm doing. Let me stop that and save on internet cost. Okay, let's see. Let me see here. The magic ore, where does he live? Okay, so I have to, yeah. Okay. I know where to go now. I forgot completely where the fuck to go. Oh, you're Thal? Hello there. As long as you've been playing recently, I have not removed you. <laughs> That's strange to think that. It's nice to, it's nice to see you. I don't see many Fago friends in anything else that's not related to Fago. Well, except for Nab, aka Soup. Let me see. No, not there. Nope, not there either. Not there. Right there, no. I'm pretty sure it's right here. You skipped the last two reruns? It's alright. Oh, you mean- please, Gay for Edison, one of the greatest dudes out there alive. No, he's still- he's still in Trash Alliance. He's never said anything. I don't need Gay for Edison to say anything, I just need him to exist. Everyone loves Gay for Edison. Hello, Mr. T's friend, welcome to the- welcome to the stream. I- I love- I love Gay for Edison. He's my only friend who uses two Edisons at level 100 and P5 both skills. <laughs> I think they're also both level 100. There's dedication to the craft. And I'm a big fan of it. I wish I had the kind of guts to actually, instead of getting rolling for NP2 quets, I should have made two quets. He probably does have three, if I'm being honest. If at last I checked, if they ever give us the ability to use Summer Edison when, if only Summer Edison was popular enough to warrant a Summer version. I mean, it's not like popularity has ever stopped someone from being a Summer unit. Yeah, Quetz is worth the MP2. I don't regret that. I'm very happy. Yeah! Perfect. Arcade exclusive, please don't. I can't handle more arcade exclusives. It's bad enough that they got Kid Koo. Kid Cootie. Everyone's favorite. Here's the man who will fix my sword. Listen here, you son of a bitch. I have a wall. Fix my broken sword. Alright. Oh wait, I think I have to talk to him first. Uh, nope. Don't need to hear it. How about you- Oh, damn it! <laughs> I was gonna say, why don't you eat shit, Patch? This sucks. Alright, one moment. Because I have to wait for it to get completely by, and then I'll deal with these motherfuckers. 
Um, the reason is lore. I think it's because Edison just likes the lion because it symbolizes America to him. That's always been my understanding of it. But the other understanding of it is that the Japanese don't 100% know America very well. <laughs> So they pick the lion over something like, um, the bald eagle. There we go. How you like that? Give me my fucking sword. Damn right. We can now shoot laser beams. Yeah, he's every single president in one. Every. President. Past and future. Yeah. Which is a shame because I like their idea of, um... The... They had an idea for a Lincoln servant, which sounded awesome. <laughs> it was, um... It was... Fuck, what was it? It was... I think one of them was Berserker Lincoln which would have been him during his wrestling days. Because if you don't know this, uh, Abraham Lincoln is one of two presidents that have been associated with wrestling. He was an actual wrestler back in the day. And the other one would have been Saber Lincoln, which is based around his time in the Civil War. Uh, and I think or the Civil War or as a lawyer, I forget which one of the two. <laughs> They're so hand in hand. But, um... Alright, I have to go find this fish man, because now we have the proof that we're a hero, and he should let us pass. But I always liked the idea of getting a berserker Abraham Lincoln <laughs> that was not based off of the Lincoln most people know, the most people love, but just this crazy time period in Lincoln's life where he was a wrestler on the streets. No, not exactly. Think of him like... I'm trying to think of the best way of saying it. He doesn't have, like, infinite person- because he doesn't have their personalities, he just has their power. He's got, like, a mech suit, powered by the power of the presidency. Yeah, that's probably the best way- yeah, have you ever seen Go Kiger? Or Power Rangers Megaforce? Or yeah, or nursery rhyme. You can go with that. I cannot find this man again. I have to look at the stupid map. Maybe I have to go to the past. I can't remember where I met that damn Zora. Which is a shame because this part of the game was just like completely mind-boggling to me back then because there was so much fucking poison everywhere. Okay, we'll go here. So yeah. yeah, Edison is just every single president. He's America. And for a brief, I think the reason it's Thomas Edison is because he is the most like capitalism. So they just made it Edison. Which kind of fits. At first I was like, I don't get it, why was it Thomas Edison? Now it kind of makes sense. It's for a very specific side of America that I think is pretty funny that they paid that much attention to. Here we go. There he is. I'm the hero of your fucking people, let me through. I went inside a big fish. There we go. Yeah, another weird for go fact. We have plenty of weird. Yeah, also Fogo is a fucking liar because Napoleon is a heroic spirit. And Napoleon is younger than the first American president. And so is Marie Antoinette. They're, I think what the what they actually mean is is that they don't want to make American servants because they're racist. Just kidding. I don't actually think that. I just think it's funny that they don't they don't ever do it. Yeah, the Fugo rules make no sense. It's whatever they want at that exact moment. If they could figure out a way to get the most recent prime minister of Japan in the game, they would. Hello. Hello. Hello, Skullman. 
Yeah, whoever sells best in Japan, aka Drake, as a woman with huge bazungas. Okay. I'm here to help the good old pirate captain Skullman. <laughs> By the way, I love these dudes. I don't- <laughs> I wish there was more for them, but there's really- They have like a small cameo in this game, and they have another, um, cameo later on. You really helped us out. Later, dude. They did make Paul Bunyan. The greatest. Alright, let me see. I forget where I have to go now. Oops. There we go. Oh, that's where we have to go. Okay. Yeah, Kama's a dude. Is is Kama's just inside the body of of a Sakura? I forget from which timeline. I assume it's the bad one. <laughs> There's never been a Sakura from a good timeline. Actually, no, I think Pravati's from the one where she's okay. And then Kama's from the worst one. Ask me anything about Sakura. I know absolutely everything. She says Senpai and then faints. And then I think she has worms in her or something. I actually don't know much about that. Pravati is good Sakura. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> BB is digital Sakura. Melt is... Oh, okay. Blurp once again showing his terrible bias. No! I have to actually kill the Gibdos! This sucks. I didn't want it to end this way. We went through the entire game without killing a single one and then we were forced to kill them. Shit. Okay, everything worked out fine, I guess. Gonna hold on as I put my cane down. Alright. Have to use my farts. I totally said farts instead of smarts. But nobody noticed, so it's fine. Shit. Smarts. No one saw that. No one saw that coming. I know how to do this. This is ancient technique passed down from the gods. Shit. Ancient technique. Oh, okay. I guess the sword strike destroys the pillar. I did not know that. No, you're not. Fago has maybe the most fate media in the history of the world. It's actually the only fate media that you need. Serious. Go back at it. Someday Sukuhime will collab with Fago. That day is coming. God damn it. Go here. Alright, Lerp, here's your first gambo. Do I die here? Because it's looking more and more like uh, that's a yes. <laughs> oh, 
on. No. Wait, can I just go here? Yes, I can. So focused on fate lore. Yeah. All right, I did it. Never mind. Cancel the gambo alert. I did not die in here. It's nothing but winning. This is gonna be a no kill stream. I'm willing to bet that right now. If I had money to bet, that would be my bet. What in the world? Some pretty good music, though. What? They can just shoot me from fucking across? That's some cheating. Alright, you know what? Nope. These things have crazy range, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna dig for some hearts. There's one. Thank you. <gasps> Perfect! My greatest friend is as always the shovel. Yeah, I don't know, those are apparently the hardest bosses in this entire game. They got like a sword hand, and <laughs> they're all powerful. Get out of my way. No! Not like this, not like this, not like this. Wouldn't you, if you were dying? There's a lot of questions over Link eating hearts that uh, we can't get into because I don't have- I don't know the moral implica the implications. It is purple Wookie. Hello. Welcome. Six. I'm gonna call you Six because I don't actually know how to pronounce your name. I got some sick money. Six will be 98. Six will be 98. All right. See, that's easy enough to remember. I know your name. I just don't know how to pronounce it. I remember you. It's not a case of me forgetting. Dig, 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 down. Dig, 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 down. Dig, 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 dig. I'm really glad we went out to go get the strongest sword just to completely get washed by these two dudes. <laughs> oh, six pound. Okay. I can do that. More money. Whoever told you. Yes! Okay. We can stop. I got $500, and I got a laser sword. No one can stop me now. Really? Well, okay, I'll do the same. Your name- I- I, pr I pronounce things exactly how I see them. So, I would call you 6LB98. 520 blaze it. How am I doing that? Doing this? Because I'm sick. None can stop me. Get out of my face, ghost. The reason I'm able to do that is because I got the better sword. So in this game, you can't actually get the master sword unless you have both versions of the game. Okay, let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Let me go feed this bird some seed. Open your ears to the sound of a sword against the wall. I 
I mean, if you've lo if you <laughs> if you didn't summon on the Dragalia Remix, then there's no reason for you to continue to summon. What? I'm not hearing anything different. Did you fucking lie to me? It's, a, it's unfortunate that my sword noise changes with the the magic ball, so... That's a rip. That's why I didn't pull. It's because I knew I would get nothing but Galazena. And I already have Galazena, so I'll just save it for another day. Go through here. Okay. So I'm gonna go here. Stay away from me. Get your back. Yeah, no reason to summon for just dragons alone. Unless the dragon is like the... I mean, I guess the if it was a solo bunny raid up, I would totally do it if the bunny had not been... <laughs> they've done their best to make sure the bunny is not used by anyone anymore. The GameCube bunnies, G and C. Hmm, weird. No more bombs, huh? Could've swore they would give me more bombs right here, but I guess they don't. Alright, let's see. This puzzle I can solve easy peasy. Yeah, the robots are permanent. Oh, I know what to do here. This is using... You can tell that this is the final dungeon, because it's literally using... Not the final dungeon, but... Pretty close to it, because it's using almost absolutely everything. That's a good sign. Yeah, Bunny was too strong, and they realized that. Which is why they've done their best to make sure Bunny is not usable in anything outside of specifically the water content they already created. <laughs> Damn it, I lost my magic sword. How easy is the Monsters Inc. event? If you, if you are grinding right now from the start, I would just not even bother. The Monsters Inc. event is maybe one of the most annoying fucking events to play. It is maybe my least favorite. <laughs> of the ones they've done. It is so fucking annoying. To the point where you may as well not even play it. I got the last... To show you what I... Like, in Cinderella, I got basically absolutely everything. I got... Yeah, I got absolutely everything from the EX. Um... From the, from the EX, uh... Shit, what word am I really looking for? Why am I being dumb? From the EX fight, all the metal items from there, I got absolutely everything. In Monsters Inc., the second I stopped, um, the second I had everything, I stopped. I stopped playing. I stopped playing EX, and I went just straight to dailies. I'm like, I don't even have the the extra epithet epithet thing, the thing that you can put on your wall to say like, oh man, I did so good in Monsters Inc. I don't even want that shit. 
I'm like four fights away from it. I don't want to deal with it anymore. It's just super annoying and it takes forever. And everyone is absolutely terrible at it. And there are no good <laughs> red units for the fight. There's only two. Yeah, just train horses. Train horses. Be happy. That's what I did. I actually did both at the same time. Because I have horse girls on my PC. Because if Horse Girls was on my phone, I would not be playing Horse Girls. It's so time consuming. It literally takes everything from- it takes like two hours to do anything. Yeah, I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing in that game in general as well, and I still have tons of fun with it. That's the good thing about it. Go back. It is extremely complex. The world's most complex game is a game in which you race horse girls. What a world. And I say that with Genshin technically being the most complex looking of all of them, because it's an actual 3D game and somehow it is easier to understand. Pretty Derby. It is, um... Uma Musumi Pretty Derby by Psy Games. It is the number one... <laughs> It is currently the number one app store in both Japan and Android because Japan loves horses. And they also love these horse girls. It like beat out- <laughs> when Hoi Toy released it prevented Genshin from getting first place. It prevented Dokkan from getting first place. <laughs> it prevented Fugo from getting first place. It was really funny. To be fair, Fugo didn't actually release anything like- it's like dude's banner rerun, so... Not to discount dudes in Fago, but if Do if Fago discounts males in their own game, then what am I to do? Ow, 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 ow. No, it's not the same level of time consuming. It's different. Do, 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 do. Okay, can't go there yet. We go up here. <laughs> you also, I think, uh... Oh, damn it. Did I do the right thing? I'm gonna say I did the wrong thing. Cause I'm about to come back here and damn it, I did the wrong thing. There's no way for me to go back, so I have to go back the old way. Oh. Okay. Oh. Killed him. What are the skeleton called? Um, Lerp? What are the skeletons called in with um Legend of Zelda? I forget the names. Stalfos, that's what they are. This is an evil dungeon filled with evil things. We're in the eighth we're in the seventh dungeon, so we only have two more dungeons left in the game. This is the last one to find the, the essence we need, and then after that, it's climbing the Black Tower and beating the game. Said 8th? Yeah, it's the 8th one. So the Black the black Tower is the ninth. I need to get my shield up. Ah, uh, what? <laughs> what do you mean the shield doesn't work against that? It's horseshit. What's the point of the shield? Oh god, no. Well, ask me any other questions you have about gacha games because this next part is gonna be a pain in the ass. Okay, I've already fucked up. Cool. 
So we need to end over there. I think... Go here. Go here. Uh, no. Ganon is not the bad guy in this game. It is a hot, um, wizard lady. Ven who I want to call Ventress, but her name is not Ventress. And I'm fucked up. Okay, back. Okay, back here. Let me just do a quick... Nope, and I've entered the same situation. So I have to get all these to, to light up. But I have to do it in one straight go. I screwed up again. I like Adventures 1 and 2 the most, and then I stopped watching Digimon. Like most people, except for Lerp. Nope, that was also bad. Now let me go here. Go here. Go here. Go. Okay, no. Yay, I screwed up again, god damn it. I need to see the new Digimon um anime. I may I think I need to see season three again with a not child's per perspective of they've changed absolutely everything I love about Digimon. This sucks. Fuck your card game. Um, and see if that will make me think it's better. Because at the time as a kid, I was really angry that it seemed like they were replacing the main Digimon concept for a card game. Okay, I've, I've realized what my mistake is here. Okay, let's see if I repeat it here though. Oh, God damn it, I totally did it again. Alright, back at it. Okay, go here, go here, go here, go here. Felt like I had something, but I did not. Okay, this is where I stop. Okay. Ah! Okay, someone was just liking a YouTube comment I made a while ago. Thank you for the support, if you, if you ended up watching this. God damn it, I fucked up again. <sighs> that was the idea, but I screwed up and those two panels are left over. Alright, back at it again. Wait. No, that was a bad mistake. It was dumb. Hmm. 
No, so close again. It is always those two panels. <sighs> okay. Back at it once again. For another hair brazing puzzle. Oh, you know what? That would be good too if I save that instead. doing in here? I was doing this. No, it's bad. Once again. <laughs> it's unfortunate that you can't make a gambo for this room, because let me tell you, I'm going to be here a while. I can already feel it. This is a thing that totally stalked me as a child. You know, some say doing the same thing over and over again, inspecting this different results, is a sign of insanity. But to them, I say, perhaps. But some days, it just works out. This isn't one of those days, though. God damn you. Alright, let me try a different approach. It was already a bad approach. It's another bad approach. I'm gonna go back to the tried and true tactic. Okay, so what if... No, because that's the same... It's the same issue. Only with different blocks. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> this room did, in fact, cause the Joker to be formed. It is pure madness. Oh god. What was I doing? I was doing this. Why did I do that? Okay, let me see. What if I did... this? <laughs> oh god damn it, it's the same two fucking squares. Alright. This time. New approach. No. I can't start from there because No, that's also bad. That's also bad. Feels like this is definitely the way to go, but then at some point I have to take a deep dive. So what if... I ignored that completely. And fucked myself over. Oh wait, no, if I keep that... Okay, I'll remember that. So bad. No, it's it's the the real problem with this is my extremely bad memory, which is what's also causing a huge disturbance in my force.
Nope. That was a dead end regardless. Okay. New approach. Figuring it out. I've completely screwed myself over. Me? What is going on? Who is commenting on everything? Okay, I see what's going on here. <laughs> Hopefully that stops the sound. I don't know if you guys can hear the doo 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 but it totally keeps happening and it throws me off my rhythm. Oh, what was I even fucking doing? I was doing this. Okay, good. As long as you guys have to hear it too, then I feel slightly better. Why did I do that again? No. I have to go new approach. New approach. New Wokey. New approach. New Wokey, new approach, new Wokey, new approach, new Wokey, new approach. Yeah! Boom. Pop off. Excuse me as I play the song of my people. Damn right. Let me, let me bring the panda. Get in on this too, panda. Get in on this. Okay. And we got a big ass glove. We got the power glove. Now we're fucking playing with power. You have no idea what Link has in his power in his possession now. He's now gonna be able to beat Super Mario Bros. 3 first try. Even though technically speaking, Lucas is lost in the wizard movie. <laughs> Boom. Fucks up ghosts. They seem to not care about my awesome strength. OJ Limps Limpson. Whoa! With his horse, Johnny Cochran. Oh, Horse Girl should do a crossover with <laughs> Legend of Zelda and Adipona. I don't know if the world's ready for that, for um, for that version of Epona, but what's my favorite rap battle? That one from the Eminem movie where the Falcon has to look like man, Eminem. Why are you being so mean? I'm just trying to be the Falcon. There's my answer. Epona has a jump stat. She does. She has the best stamina in the game. I actually can't think of too many real life rap battles, because I think most real life bat rap battles I need like structure to my rap. So I need to <laughs> I need to hear their thought process. I prefer rap when it's just like because when you just ask dudes like, hey, what's on the top of your head? It's the world's most shitty like response. It's like abba doob dub die. What's up, my homies? I hope you die. And then there's like 30 other dudes going, Oh shit. Fucking told. And it's just not for me. But that's, in my mind, that's the only way to do a rap battle, so... Where do I go now? Speaking of rap battles. No, not here. Super hot fire. I'll default to Nab in whatever he says is the best rap battle. I trust his taste. Go here. No. 
Now we're in a new quest. Where the hell do I go? Oh, Superman vs. Goku? I don't listen to any of those. <laughs> All power to you if you like those, but I've never listened to one of those. Who would I think would win in a rap battle, Superman or Goku? Neither one. Neither one has any lyrical style to them to themselves at all. I can't even trust Goku to form full on sentences and I'm expected to hear him rap. Impossible. Oh god. Oh my leg fell asleep. This is bad. Oh god. The pain, it's immense. I'm hurting bad. I'm down bad in an actual legit way, not in a <laughs> in a bad Twitter way. Let's see, can I push this now? No, I can't. I don't think there's anything for me here to do. Can I just hit this? <laughs> I totally can. Shit, where do I go now? Let me see. Am I gonna 100% it? No. I'm not. I have everything that matters. I have the the sword and I have the the main game, which is what matters. I raised up Baby Lerp, which we should really visit Baby Lerp at some point. See how he's doing. I think he's fine. Before the stream ends, we will visit Baby Lerp to see if Baby Lerp is up and at him. And see how many years have passed since Link started this adventure. Yes, this is what I wanted, I think. This is in fact not what I wanted, but it's fine. No, damn you. I lose my super awesome beam every time I take a hit. Okay, let me go the other way. Boop boop. I mean, clearly they want me to do something with this. But I feel like I've already done everything that I can do over here. Oh no, what I need to do is hit the blue. And come back here when it's blue. Get out of here. Leave. Boink. No? Is that not the answer? Might be time to hit up the old guide pretty soon. Oh, I see what I have to do, I think. So get that there. No. Get this here. No, I know. <sighs> I'm gonna look it up. One moment. Okay, let's see what happens after I get the big thing. Oh. I didn't even think about that. Okay. That makes perfect sense. I forgot I could do that. Excuse me. I was like, oh, how do I make it from over there? I was supposed to do this. Out of my way, bats. There we go. Perfect. 
Made it. Somehow you can't jump over these, but you can still be on top of them, if that makes any sense. Boom, boom. Alright, down we go. And now... Now I lost my super awesome light beam. It did look illegal. It looks like something that you shouldn't be able to do. But yet the game says, no, that's how you have to beat this. Come on, give me one heart. Don't give me money. Money can't buy me hearts. Alright. Now I'm gonna fight the Grim Reaper. Ah! Ah, what the fuck? Okay, I have to hit him solid. Nope. That wasn't solid. What in the name of fucking hell do I do here? Ah, damn it! <laughs> Are you serious? Alright. Okay, what the fuck is the shield's purpose if it cannot stop the Grim Reaper? Come on. Come on. I'm here. Do it. You son of a bitch. Give me a straight one. I hate you so much. What? No! Oh no! I'm baby! What am I supposed to do? Okay. I'm not baby anymore. I'm adult. Y'all saw that too, right? Did I turn into a baby for a second? I'm not going crazy here as the game goes on. That I'm actually fighting the Grim Reaper, whose baby form is as a bat. I can do this all day, Reaper man. Come back here, you fucking baby. That's what you get for dealing with the power of the level 2 sword. I just killed the baby. Baby death, but still. That was a child. Eat this. Oh no, he didn't eat it. <laughs> he got him there, though. Yeah, you've heard of Baby Lurp. Say hello to Baby Wookie. Coming soon to a theater near year, the extended baby universe. Pretty sure I have to do something here, besides just avoid their big damage. <laughs> Woki GT. Step into the Grand Tour. Grand Tour, Grand Tour. Step into the Grand Tour, Dragon Ball GT. Oh! Step into the Grand Tour, Grand Tour, Grand Tour, step into the Grand Tour, Dragon Ball GT. Ooh. Ooh. That's about all I know about the Step into the Grand Tour song. Ooh. Ooh. There's some English themes for Dragon Ball that are amazing that they were approved. <laughs> there was really a like, well, this is like what cartoons are for most Americans. We can't just try and translate the Japanese song. It's not gonna work. Yeah, I, saw, I sung the important parts. <laughs> That's the trick. I'm actually both. 
How can you live with yourself? Sick flip. Flip. You can't stop these flips. They're too sick. Thank you for the key. What are these even supposed to be? Eyeball monsters? I don't know. I don't trust it. Gotcha seed. I got a slate? That's a new one. But thank you for the slate. Give. Oh, the level 2 sword can just destroy shit. They're Beyblades. That somehow makes the most sense. Beyblade. I can just destroy things. That's the power of the level 2 sword. No more needing to pick up anything. This is true power. This also means the chances of me accidentally destroying something are 10 times higher. Can I bomb it? Because it looks like I can't bomb it. Looks like a bombable wall. Nope, I was wrong. <clears throat> oh god. Damn it, and I lost my awesome power. Power here one day, power gone the next. Getting tired of these bastards. Oh, okay. Now I know why I need slates. Eat this. Da <laughs> Bastard! <laughs> Yes, I'm both. I also throw laxatives in people's mouths, like Japan did. Oh, okay. I can just do that later. I would also like Chainsaw Man to come back already. It's been too long. It's been too long since I've heard the rev of the chainsaw. Thank you. Oh, I can just jump over. I'm a dumbass. I was about to go all the way around without ever doing this. Whee! Gotcha seed. Out of my way. Oh, don't tell me I have to... Oh, thank you. Run! I got it, though. There we go. What in the name of hell? Okay, everything's fine. Whee! Oh, I thought it was gonna work like Pokemon Ice. <laughs> I was about to just go sliding for the rest of it. You son of a bitch. Get over here. You're lucky I don't have my laser sword right now. I'm gonna hit you with some hot fire. Eat that. Wee. Wee. And there's another stone tablet for me. Thank you very much. Back in the cart. I don't think there's anything else for me over here, so I can just go. Later. Okay, let's see. Oh, that would have been the place. That's cool. Ah, oh, these fucking guys. It is futile. <laughs> Oh, this sucks. I can already tell this sucks. Because I'm with these kamikaze candles. Ah, you bastard. Sniper shot. 
Link's sniper training. The sequel to Link's bow adventure that everyone's been waiting for. Hello, Gibdos. Get over here. I unfortunately need to kill you to see if I can get a heart. John Link. Instead of John Wick. I didn't realize that it would just make it sound like someone was named John Link. <laughs> God damn it, this fucking mermaid suit back at it again. Jellyfish blood. I'm not gonna give that bird anything. How is that bird breathing underwater? It's a fucking bird. Oh god. This looks like it sucks. Oh god. Alright, so this is the part where I die now. Oh god damn it. I'm really about to die here. It's a magical birdfish. Son of a bitch! Why? Uh, I'm just actually reading all the Ghost Rider comics right now. So I'll tell you when I get there. For now I'm enjoying the 1970s stuff. I really didn't like the old Cowboy Ghost Rider. Cowboy Ghost Rider was a big suck, which is why they changed his name to the Phantom Rider. But I'm enjoying the current 1970s stuff. Alright, I'm leaving. So I never have to do that again. They knew how savage that fish- that swimming part was. They put that there. But I don't like Ghost Rider because he's mainly a- Ghost Rider is this weird outlier where he's apparently just a flaming skull that cannot be killed by anything. And eventually I'll get to the point. I'm not I'm not even at his like strongest form. Apparently he gets way stronger way later on. So that's going to be fun. But he was able to beat the Hulk pretty easily because his idea was the 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 Hulk doesn't need oxygen. I'll just remove it from him. So he totally fucking does. Like, wow, okay. The, the Hulk can't get angry if he can't breathe. Alright, go here. Wrong one. Really? Y'all really gonna make me go all the way? Wait, what? Am I crazy? What did I get from over there? Did I not get a stone tablet? Gonna ignore that for now and get the last one. Maybe I need a specific one. Maybe that's why it's not working. These motherfuckers. Aw oh, man, are you serious? Alright. And then this right here. Come on. Nicolas Cage Ghost Rider? Uh, I, re I remember watching that movie in theaters when it came out. I think they're aged probably bad. They're not as good as you would want from a Ghost Rider movie featuring Nicolas Cage. That's what I remember him. Which is to say that it's not enough Nick Cage. Which is a shame, because Nick Cage loves comic book movies. What did I even get from there? Okay. Don't know why I did that, but I could do that, apparently. Ooh, come back. Go here. 
I like Nicolas Cage, though. Nicolas Cage is cool. Bold statement, I know. Nicolas Cage is cool. Their trip. Here's what I know about Ghost Rider. Ghost Rider is the spirit of vengeance, and he has a move called the Penance Stare that if you do anything bad, it basically is a one-hit KO. It is probably the most crazy powerful move if you are evil. That's a pretty good Nick Cage movie. There's, a, there's plenty of good Nick Cage movies out there, though. Another slate? My brother has. My brother watched the Nick Cage Five Nights at Freddy's movie. He told me it was very good, but also he... We wanted to do a video... <laughs> yeah, I saw Mandy. I like Mandy, even though <laughs> it's probably too art house for some people. Um... What was I about to fucking say before I completely got distracted by Mandy? Um, there was gonna, I was gonna do a, a, a video with my brother for Halloween where we looked at, he told, he basically would try to explain to me the plot of Five Nights at Freddy's, and it was gonna be like a five hour down, five hour long breakdown video as he goes through every single one of them, um, and we never had time to record it. Shame. Would've been fun. Maybe next year. But my brother is what taught me a lot about Five Nights at Freddy's. He told me that there's a man behind the slaughter. Yeah, he <laughs> he won't. <won't, laughs> I told him that because he's like, well, I need to buy the book. And I was like, why do you need to buy the book? He's like, because the book is lore important. And I said, I will pay for this book if you will contribute to a video. I was like, I need every single thing. He's like, all right, fine. When I find the book on sale, I'll tell you and you can buy it for me. It never- it just never ended up happening. If you want to bother Nooks about it, you can add him and say, when's that Five Nights at Freddy's video coming? Damn it! There is a 2099 Ghost Rider. I need the boss key. I don't know where to find the boss key, though. Oh, duh. It's probably right there. Is it literally right there? <laughs> totally is. Alright, going back. The Fred and Nomicon. It really is. It is in-depth. He knows perhaps too much about the Freddy lore. I swear, if this is actually the... Okay, weird place to put the boss key, but it's fine. It was close by. Oh god. Yeah! You know that there are multiple wrestling games featuring Fred Durst? Where he has like, uh, because he did the intro, he did Roland. The Roland song is his, but The Undertaker used it for his intro for very many years before he switched over to the much worse song by Kid Rock. Um, but there's a lot of WWE video games where if they want to use rolling, <laughs> they have to ask Fred Durst permission to use it. And I think his one stipulation was, put me in the game. And they were always like, okay, we can do that. Okay. What is this guy? What? There's just no <laughs> explanation for some of these bosses. Okay, I see what to do now. I think. Okay, never mind. Do I have to hit his hand back at him?
I feel like that's not the answer. Maybe if I try this? Okay, the answer is just throw bombs at him until he dies. Okay, I hit him with that. Yeah, no. I just don't know. There's multiple ways to beat this one boss. I'm gonna kill you, sir. What the fuck? Okay, this is the part where I put the bomb on. Go right here. That was a bad idea. Oh god. He clearly wants a hug, but he's not gonna get one from me. He can get a bomb though. Come on. I really don't have any bombs. <laughs> I hate this guy. I hate his fucking face. Get over here. It has to be so specific right in between the arms. Some. I had to approach him from up top. Okay, so now I think I need to switch over to these kind of bombs. Shoot him in the face. What the fuck? Okay, I don't know how to fight this guy. He has like seven different ways to fight him. <laughs> Come on. Oh god! This is the most aim perfect boss you have to fight against. It's super annoying. Okay, I'll take that bank shot. Now I can use this. Right? I gotta use the other one, I guess. Really? No? Okay. Don't use that. Okay, I know what to do now. He's literally just gonna use every single thing possible. Is it really not this either? Oh, 
Oh, I'm running out of stuff that it could potentially be. It's not the cane. And I'm dead. I don't know what to do for that final fight. I used basically everything I had. Maybe I really do have to try and pick up his hands? I don't know. I feel like the answer is pick up his hands and it's not letting me- it wasn't letting me pick up his hands. Yeah, I noticed that too. Try that again. Wait, what am I doing? He's Braun Strowman, that's why it's taking me so long. Well, he's about to go to Suplex City, as soon as I figure out how to fucking turn correctly. He's very lucky I can't throw bombs from behind him. Try this again. I really don't think that's what it is. But every time I try and do anything else, it doesn't work. Alright, let's try another weapon. Can I shield it? I'll try using the switch again. Nothing. Alright.
No, it's literally telling me it's doing nothing. Alright, let's see. Maybe grab the arm. Today's not daylight savings time. I don't think so. Let me check. No, I thought it would be tomorrow. That's dumb. The only reason it didn't work is because I wasn't... Get over here. I wasn't close enough to the stupid ball so it didn't count as being held. You guys saw, I tried multiple times, I just wasn't close enough. Doesn't matter. Head over to the final, final dungeon. Let's see, if they remade this game, they would fix the. <laughs> they would fix the collision. Because there was just no way for me to tell if I was close or not. Thank you, Wookie. You've gathered all the essence of time. Now I can create something that will aid you, Wookie. Please visit me after you've grown up. I'll wait for you, no matter how long. Alright, sounds good. Let's get the fuck out of here. It's time to go visit Tree Wife. Oh, it's a cemetery. That's interesting. Oh, it doesn't let me. That's cool. Boing. All right, let's go visit the tree. Old man trouble. Before we visit the tree, we actually need to visit one other person. We need to go visit Baby Lurp. Sup, old man. Let me actually appraise some rings. Actually, no. If I remember right, there was something I was supposed to buy. I'm pretty close, yeah, for sure. I don't think I'll be getting them all. But there's something I can get right here.
Oh yeah, listen to that great rupee sound. <laughs> I think we need... So I'm missing like what? I'm missing five heart containers. And we would be able to get a full heart. It's not bad. That's almost 100%. Oh wait, what? Yeah, so let me go visit Baby Lurp. That's what I was doing. We need to go make sure that he's okay. He's in here. No! Still hospitalized. But he's getting better. We'll come visit him later. When we beat the game, of course. Don't step in my time puddle, old man. You will be sent back to the past. Okay, you've collected all eight essences of time and know their power. Thanks to you, time flows true to me once again, and I remember all I had forgotten. I'm the guardian of Naru, Oracle of Ages, and my Maku Seed can make can be used only by a hero who knows the powers of the essence of time. The hero who knows the essence of time sees unwavering truth across time and space. If you can do this, Woki, you can stop Baron. Take this. She's giving me her big nut. You got a huge Maku Seed? This should penetrate evil. No! No! Give up, Wookie. Don't you know all your efforts are for naught? That's right. If you thought they weren't in this game, here they are. The Gerudo Witch's Twin Robo. This world is ours to manipulate. No matter how much you struggle, the Dark Rites will begin soon. Remember our names. It is Borsaro, the name Twin Robo. <laughs> one. There's only one place left. Wookie, it's Twin Rova. Twin Rova? Who thought the terrible Gerudo Witch's Twin Rova would appear? What could her plan be? I'm filled with sorrow, just as Twin Rova hoped. The world is doomed. You must stop Queen Ambi at the Black Tower and cast down Varen, please. You got it, Tree Wife. Thank you for the giant nut. I'm off. Technically seed. She did not give me a giant nut. She gave me a big seed. Cause she's respectful. Let's roll. Dun, 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 dun. There's Rolf. Hello, Rolf. So, Woki, you finally made it. I came to destroy Varen. Varen is taking control of Queen Ombi, right? Then to beat Varen, I must defeat Queen Ombi. Um, well, Queen Ombi, Varen, I'll destroy the both of you. Then the people of this age and our age will have peace. But what will happen to me? Um, Woki, don't you forget me. I mean, I think of you as a friend. Okay, I'm going to Ralph can do that. Goodbye, Woki. She is in Oracle season. She's in both games. Woki, wait. Woki, I was researching the past and found something awful. Uh, it's Neb's comment. It was just <laughs> straight up horrible. <laughs> Ralph is a descendant of the Queen Ambi. Do you know what this means? If Ralph has sex with his queen mother, he won't be born, just like in Back to the Future. Ralph lives now because Ambi lived in the past. If Ambi is slain, Ralph will never exist. I came to try and stop Ralph, but I couldn't. Woogie, please stop. Ralph, he means to sacrifice himself for the people for this age by slaying Queen Ambi. I can't allow Ralph to make such a sacrifice. You're the only one who can save Ralph and all of us, Woki. Impa and I will find a way to give strength to the villagers. Please, Woki, save Ralph. Technically, it's not a Back to the Future situation. It is a Futurama situation where um, Fry had sex with his grandma, which allowed him to be his own grandfather. The Black Tower. Alright, let's go. Snakes! In this room, I just want nothing but snakes. Get out of the construction site, dude. Slime. Damn it. Stop taking away my magic powers. I need those for winning. Obviously, I know what to do here. 
blend in. Hello, sirs. What are you doing? I'm one of you! Wait, I'll just go over here. Hello, snakes. Good friends. Just move it on. Just a simple little Octorok. Oh god. I can't attack in this form, by the way. <laughs> no! <laughs> Why are you hitting me? Alright, it's not fun if there's dudes with swords here. Y'all gonna be like that, then. I'm just gonna lay waste. Eyeball. Give devs. Die. Thank you, Gibdo friend, for the return of my laser sword. Thank you, Gibdo friend, for taking away my laser sword. Oh, these fucking like likes. No one likes you. Does anyone like a like like in a Legend of Zelda game? If so, then I can just tell you you're wrong. Who likes something that eats away one of your weapons? Later, dudes. I dodged that arrow with panache. Whoop! Out of my face. Ah, oh, god damn it. I lost my fucking magic power again. I don't want to fight the ghost though, so. We are at an impasse. How fucking dare you? They do seem like etchy manga monsters. The worst, best kind of monsters, depending on what chapter. They do. They do cost. God. I can't believe that we've had basically the same shield since the beginning of the game. The big nut. No! How am I supposed to get my KFC collab? Both me and Soup are devastated. As both fans of KFC and Genshin. Here it is. I think this is the- I think first we fight- no. Of course not. It can never be that simple. How- why would they do this? Oh yeah, I saw that people kept stealing the stand-ins. People are sick. How dare they. Did Japan learn nothing from the curse of the colonel? How their baseball team was forced to lose forever because they kept stealing because they stole um, the KFC Colonel one time. This guy is the hardest boss in the entire game. This guy right here, that guy was basically a mid boss. these dark nuts. Oh, were you wedding the KFC curse? Yeah, that's real. Or at least that was a real curse that people believed in. I should say, to be more accurate. Um... I think during during a heated moment, a heated gaming moment in, in, in baseball, someone stole the KFC kernel and they dunked it in a river, and since then they said that KFC was cursing them. What is going on here? 
is the most confusing. This is why it's the final place, because it's the most confusing I've been in. Uh, hopefully I, I picked the right one, <laughs> I don't know. Damn these knife-throwing bastards. I picked the wrong door. I think you can end Lerp's bet thing, because I died. <laughs> oh, I do not have time for you, friend. Yeah, it's very likely Lurp passed out, which is why he gave the command to end the gamble. And follow the flyer and see if it takes me anywhere. Okay, so yeah, totally one of these fires disappeared. Okay, no. Not one of them did. Alright, I guess I just... Okay, nope, that was the wrong room. Let me guess, I have to find the bird. And the bird will tell me which one of these to pick. I got time to find a bird. So here's what's actually gonna happen. I'm just gonna try every single door until I find the right one. Wasn't that one. Wasn't that one either. I'm gonna die to this ghost before I do anything. Maybe it's this one. <laughs> Goddamn sniping jackalope thing. Oh man. Okay. Pokemon Red and Blue for the Thunder Gym. Lieutenant Surge? Ow, stupid ghost. I was like so confused about the comment that I got hurt. I was like, what the hell are you talking about? Okay. I hate this guy. This guy is the hardest boss in all of Legend of Zelda. He's like the, uh... The red armor in um, Ghost and Goblins. Did I start back at the beginning? Yes, I did. It's fine. I wanted full health anyway. Don't 
Fuck off. You don't think I'm too proud to just kill you from over there, sir? Because I'm not. Oh, okay, that one. I was like, okay. What are you... I get what you're saying. I don't know. Hey, <laughs> Got it. And I almost died. Let's get it. Woo! Out of my way. I don't want to fight anyone but the boss. You must be Ralph of Zombie's Lime. Ha, huh, I have no time for such a small fry. Be gone with you. Or do you mean to fight me? Don't make me laugh. Fool, this is the body of Zombie's, your ancestor. If you slay me, you will vanish from this world. Do you still wish to fight? You trickster. Fine, if I slay you, I vanish. Maybe it is terrifying. But if I must do, to do nothing and live just isn't me. This means nothing. I will destroy you to protect the people of this age and to protect Naru. Instant loss. Oh, okay. Because of my kindness, your wrong young Ralph still lives. But you still attack me? If you damage Ambi's body, Ralph will vanish. You can't intend to end your dear friend's life by your own hands. Did you fucking forget that I can just beat you? I couldn't do it. I don't look that fool. Naru. You come despite my warning? Do you not value your life? Or are you a mere fool? Regardless, it won't be easy. I'll teach you your place. I'll not be as kind as before. Dude, I literally know how to beat you. Or did you forget? And I got your fucking number. Out of my way. Summon all your snakes. I can beat them all. <laughs> I like how I said snakes, but these are totally spiders. <laughs> been a long night. Spiders. Like, literally, I knew how to beat you from this jump. I'll never expect to be beaten by this boy. Did you fucking forget that I beat you before? What happened? I feel as though I've been caught in a bad dream. As if pure evil had inhibited my body. What? I must leave at once. I see worry in your eyes. I should have done as well as I was told. Yeek. Well done. I thought I would possess you this time. Perhaps you have a different flavor from that fool Ralph? You've seen me like this before, but this is my true form. You'll regret making me show my true might. What? I'll give you a reason to fear Varen, Sorceress of Shadows. Oh, it's Dark Links. Can I just... There we go. I mean, they're literally going the opposite side of you, lady. So I don't know what you think. Get back here. Ooh, heart. Heart. All that did was help me. Well, Naru, uh, he's supposed to be protecting Naru. And Din, if you play the other game, too. This should not have happened to me. Loki, are you alright? Loki, you did it. Even I thought it was over this time. But Naru was there, she can't always remain helpless. I'm going to train so I'll be able to protect Naru on my own. You've finally beaten Varen. Now the chaotic flow of time should return to normal. Shall we go back to the village?
You won't get away so easily. Oh. Vanellope. How cold of you to run off and leave me all alone. But my, aren't you courageous? You spoiled all my plans. I hope to avoid revealing this vile shape. You'll pay for my humiliation for only for your life. Now, Wookie, it is your turn to taste despair. <laughs> Ooh, boy. I'm going to take a sip. So I can do this. Let's go fight <laughs> this turtle monster. Ah! Okay, that's way more terrifying. Ooh, bombs. They want me to use bombs at some point. Ah. Oh, okay, this form is what needs to be hit by bombs. She also has, like, spider boobs, if you look. Watch, when I hit her, look right there, you see them? They're gone now. But they will show themselves right here. I'm about to die. I could have kept hitting her, but I felt bad. Oh shit. Oh god. Ah, oh, damn it. I'm gonna have to start this all from the beginning, aren't I? Yes, I am. And with less health. Can I go back? Probably can, right? Excuse me, sir. You son of a bitch. <laughs> he sniped me and took made me take a shit ton of damage that I didn't want to take. Alright. Back to the fight. And try and take less damage this time. Come here. This is what I get for laughing at her evil form. Damn it, I lost my shiny sword once again. No! Okay. Okay. <clears throat> oh, wait. <laughs> I went to go grab her. They put them all in one row. Perfect. Is it, ni it is nice of her to give me an ability to get hearts back. <laughs> she didn't need to do that. They're extremely easy to beat. 
It's not even the hardest Shadow Link Link has fought. Where is she? There she is. Where are you? Alright. Once again. Back at it again with the spider form. Thankfully, her first form is actually pretty easy to beat. Yeah, it's pretty tough. It's mainly because there's not a lot of ways to heal, so you actually have to not mess up in any of the first forms. <laughs> okay. Show me your turtle form, girl. Nope, I don't want to call Panda. Damn it, it had to be right in her face. I had to blow it up right in her face. My body withers, but you are too late in my role was to disrupt the currents of time. The flood humanity and sorrow, the despair that fills this land has already passed through this tower and on to Winrova. I see it, burning blue, the flame of sorrow. Ha ha ha. Get out of the way, Rolf and Nora. Loki, what's happening inside? Not good things. Loki, I'm so glad. You're safe, thank goodness. You really beat Varen, didn't you? Nice work, Loki. You're amazing, huh? Queen Abby, she saw you get shut in and turned and ran. Let us go. What, are you gonna take on Ralph? Wilkie, you are safe. I just called my knights from the palace to help since you were locked inside the tower. Don't startle me like that. I thought Varen's tricks had gone in you. Wilkie, thanks to you, everyone is back to normal. I thank you. And then, I have sex with Queen Ambi. And thus, Ralph is eventually formed. This is the only way that <laughs> history can <laughs> flow correctly. If I flow inside her. <laughs> Silly bunnies. Wokey, my respect for you has grown. I thought if only he heard what I said. It was over when you got locked in the tower. I never thought you'd outdo me. Ralph is my grandson's grandson's grandson? You too have great courage. You shall be the pride of my people. And you, Queen Ambi. Varen is gone, so now you can be my great 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 grandmother, a queen, if I'm proud, so proud. How rude, I'm still young, don't call me granny. I am reluctant to part, but we must return to our own age. Yeah! I think Queen Hobby looks really funny. All is well in my age, you may return without worry, we shall never forget you. Hehehe, <laughs> Wokey, don't think it ends here. Mmm, disgusting. Behold, Varen, the troubles you have caused have filled the land with cries of sorrow. It has given birth to the flame of sorrow, which burns brightly. When this flame brightens the darkness, our wish will be granted. Ho 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 ho. That's it. That's the Legend of Zero Zelda Oracle of Ages. We, in order, so that cliffhanger at the end. Only we will learn more about it when we actually play. Hey.
statue of me. We'll just let the credits rock real quick. Everyone's happy. We have to play Oracle of Seasons. So when we play Seasons, we will understand what's going on with Twin Robo. Oh, Tree Wife is happy. I got Statue of Me. Planners. Fubuyashi and Yo Ikaida. Lee Suchol. Oh, even Maple's here. Monkey. Panda. Maple just sit down. Aww. See, that's the good stuff. Look at that. Adorable. E Honda programmed his game. Shimtan. Y Sunazaki. M Namo. Ralph training. How to train your Ralph. Wee. I mean, it is Kid Kidatune, Minobi, Shibaki, Hiroki. Oh, there's them building my statue, and then carrying it to my tree. Yaw. Look how happy she is to just see the, the Link statue. That's a better look of Queen Obi. At least you get to actually see her face and her gigantic bust, holy shit. M. Loki made the sound effects with Yoko Po. Scenario by Flagship. Everyone's favorite. Character designer Yusuke Nakano. Editorial design was done by Ajin and Y Tanaka. Supervisors T Hoda, Yamada, Tezuka, M Narita, K Mizuki, M Yashichida. Original sound and advisor Keiji Kondo. Planner support Nose Take. North American localization translations and localization. Bill Trinan. The dude who still does the voice for Miyamoto whenever he translates. Text editor, text editor Teresa Lilligreen. Localization management, Leslie Swan, Jeff Miller. I cannot believe he's been working with that long. Special thanks, Ayanagi, Milky, Izumi, M. Eugenie, Minori Arakawa, Mike Fukuda, Abu, Original Zelda Zaf, The Super Mario Club, the NOA debuff, debug staff. We can't actually fit your names on this D card. Producer Narutaki Fubunaki. General producer Shigeru Miyamoto. Yoshi Yoshisiki Okamoto. Executive producer Hiroshi Yamauchi. Wait for it. Yay, it's the end. But it's not actually the end, because I think we have to go visit Baby Lerp. There's my secret password if you want to play as Wookie in your own version of the game while you wait for streams. To be continued in the Oracle of Seasons. So let's go visit Baby Lerp real quick. Yeah! <laughs> it's a pretty nice statue of me. What do you have to say to me? Ah, peace is nice. Now I can finally own- I can think only of Wookie. Damn right. Visiting baby lurp. Baby lurp visit. <gasps> this baby lurp died. Where's Baby Lerp? I'm freaking out, man. Where's Baby Lerp? Everyone's gone. 
So I think, if I remember right, um, I think we will continue to see Baby Lurp when we go to play the season. So yeah, I'm getting to your question. Don't worry. Um, let me go to save and quit. Uh, so the current plan is the next stream will be a one-off stream, and then the next stream after that will be Oracle of Seasons. I wanted to make a quick one-off stream as a breaker between the next one before I jump right into it. There will probably be like a one game. I, it, I assume I'll beat it in under an hour or so, so it'll be a very quick stream. And then I'll roll into Seasons. Uh, but that's the plan, is that Seasons is next after the one-off stream, which will probably be tomorrow. But for tonight, that's it, everyone. Thank you very much for joining me for the stream, for seeing the actual end of Oracle of Ages. Uh, thanks very much for hanging out. Uh, I don't know if you lost any money to the Gambo because his Lerp fell asleep, but I'll get that sorted out to you later. But thank you very much for joining me, and I'll see you guys in the next stream. Peace out.